Okay, now let's begin into the key players, right? The key players that we're going to be presenting to. Now, before we present, we have to get into their heads. We want to be able to know what they want to hear. What do they want to see? So let's go ahead and go into the four types of key players that's typically in a sales presentation. Let's start up with the first one, management high-level executives in that room. What are they focused on? Money. They want to know how is this going to increase the revenue company-wide? How are you going to help me with the cost? Last but not least, how is your product going to help expand market share? You know, they really want to know those things. You need to be able to answer some of these questions. Where is your company going to impact their company? Now, Let's look at the second part, the users, another group in the room potentially. What do users want to know? If it's a product or a software, they want to know how easy is it to use? You know, how easy it is to switch over? How easy can they implement this? And will there be training? Will there be support? Their biggest concern is change. Changing is something new and people resist change. So as we're doing a sales presentation, what you want to emphasize with these users in the group is that it's not hard to learn the system. It's not hard to switch over and you're going to be there to support them and you're going to show them how easy it is to use this product or your service. That's what they want to hear. We want to get into their head. Now, the third group, these are the technical people, right? The technical people. Yes. These are the type of people that gets down to the nuts and bolts. They want to get to know, is it compatible? Is it, is it upgradable? Is it expandable? Is it reliable? This is what they want to you know, have in their head. Is it worthwhile? Is it the best product in the market? How does it compare to other products, specification-wise, technically-wise? Is it the best software? It's the only software. You know, looking at the current platform, as we're presenting to technical people, right, we're going to have to actually answer these questions as we present to reduce the resistance from the audience. Last but not least, the economic buyer. Now, hmm, this is the money people, buyers, purchasing agents, right? What do they care about? Money. How do I get the best deals? They're going to ask about price. They're going to want to compare prices between your product and somebody else, some direct competitor or an alternative solution. But they're also going to ask if it's a big sale, if it's a complex sale. They want to know. What's the return on investment? What's the ROI? I'm investing in something. What's the return on investment? What's the break-even point? It's a, it's a year, two years, three years, five years. And last but not least, they might ask you about total cost of ownership, right? That's pretty much just the price of the product. Or what's the total cost of you know, ownership? You know, support, um, you know, maintenance, all these other additional costs. What's the total cost of ownership between a one, three, or five years? Right? These are the things that they want to be able to hear. They want to hear this from you guys. And you need to answer all this from the front of the room when you're doing the presentation. So right now, I'm just trying to orient to you guys what are the type of buyers or what are the type of people you're going to be presenting to and so that you know how to actually get into their mind and know what they actually really need. And I'll give you guys a quick example. You know, One of my, one of the, my backgrounds is to be able to sell, um, to sell services, home health services, medical services to patients at their home and I have to deal with the doctors. So I need to be able to talk to the physician and talk to them about, you know, how these services are going to be able to help the patients and also help the doctor. And then when I have to talk to some of their um, some of the people who's in charge of referring the patients to the agencies, for example, I need to be able to explain to them how easy it is for them to use us rather than other agencies, meaning that we're there to support them. We're there to make sure that, you know, they don't waste any time. We want to make sure that when they call us, we can accept all the different, you know, um, insurances that may be thrown on us. So these are the things that you guys have to start thinking about. It depends. It doesn't matter if it's products or services. You need to know who you are going to be talking targeting who you're going to be presenting to. You cannot speak to, for example, a physician the way you're going to speak to their office manager. Two different things because they have two different needs. So going up again that when we talk about the mute, right, the acronym mute, M for the management, U for the users, T for the technical people, and E for the economical buyer. So let's go ahead and move on to the next video. Hey everyone, we want to be able to invite you to our 10xpatientreferrals.com where we have our online home health marketing academy that's going to be able to help either a home health, home care, or hospice agency increase referrals, increase their senses, and create a profitable company.
Now, at this very moment, you're going to have access to these information through these training, marketing to physicians, how to get to hospitals, how to be able to get into nursing homes, and much, much more at a month-to-month -month basis with no contracts needed. It's just month-to-month. -month. Now, guess what? We are offering you guys for a limited time 50% off any one of our plans. Just choose which one is going to be able to work better for you. So just stop by the 10xpatientreferrals.com at any given moment. So these are the plans that are available, whether it's the gold, the silver, or the platinum plan. Most people go for the gold plan, but it's up to you what's going to work for you. We definitely want to be able to have you in, come in and work with us. So here's two choices. Go to 10xpatientreferrals.com or click the link down below. Take advantage of this right now at this very moment and sign up with us. Now, before we continue on to the video, just need to be able to take a few seconds of your time. And so we want to be able to ask you a question. Are you looking to gain more referrals for your agency, your home health, your home care, your hospice agency? We want you to be able to join us at our online marketing boot camp that has over seven and a half hours of training. When you actually watch our boot camp and join our online marketing boot camp training, so sign up for a limited time at 10xpatientreferrals.com. We would like to thank our sponsors of this video. And over here at 10xpatientreferrals.com, our goal is to provide you guys amazing information on every single one of our videos. So medicationreminderprogram.com provides daily medication reminders for your patients. They call your patients twice a day to remind them to take their medications. What happens is a top reason of hospitalization for senior citizens is not taking their medications. So this program allows you to be able to keep your patients and not lose any revenue, but at the very same time, it allows you to stand out when you are marketing to other referral sources because you're providing more services, more programs than the competition around you guys. The next thing we want to be able to share with you guys is they have three different packages available for you at this very moment. Choose which one works for you. If you're an agency that's just starting up and you have less than 10 patients, you can go with the silver plan. Or if you have 50 patients, you can go with the gold plan. Or if you have up to 100 patients, it is only the choice to use the platinum plan. But guess what? It's up to you which one works for you guys. For a cost of as a little as 33 cents per patient a day, it is worth everything for you guys. The next thing is homecareansweringservice.com. It's an answering services for your agency. So if you want to be able to have us handle all the calls for you in the weekends or the off hours when your business office is closed, we can definitely do that. Or we can even answer your calls for you during the day as well. Allows you to be able to do everything for your company. So homecareansweringservice.com is your solution for answering your calls on a timely manner. 